Hi, this is Anna from iLoveToCoupon.com. Today we're going to be talking about freezing avocados. And this works great if you're going to be stockpiling with coupons a lot of avocados. They don't, the deals like that don't come along very often, but when they do, you gotta buy a bunch. So let's start off and we'll, uh, I'll show you how to freeze avocados. Okay, this one's looking a little bad, so let's cut into it and see what that's gonna look like. Oh, it's pretty bad. I don't know if I'm going to use that one at all. But these seem more firm. Oh yeah, that one's perfect. Okay, I'm just going to scoop out this center and put it in a blender. Best way to freeze avocados is to puree them and put a little bit of lemon or lime juice in them. And that uh, keeps them from turning brown. So we'll just get that done real quick here. Oops. Yeah, there went that. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of them. Okay, so we've got all of it in the blender. So let's smush it down the very bottom now. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, you're supposed to add one tablespoon of lemon or lime juice for each avocado you put in there. So go ahead and do that. And now it's time to puree. Well, that didn't work out too well, so I decided to put it in a Ziploc bag. And this way we can get a rolling pin and kind of smash it more and mix it up a little more because the blender it would just kind of mix the bottom stuff and then the top stuff would never fall down and get blended okay here we go i'm gonna, just gonna kind of get it all pressed down i do want to say i tasted this stuff and it is pretty lemony i put lemon juice in it instead of lime so you might want to think about that um maybe use a little less but we'll see how it turns out all right, maybe it wasn't quite mixed up good enough. Please do not explode. And now we'll put it in the containers, freezer containers. I don't know if you can see that very well, but uh, I'm not putting a whole lot in each one. That way it won't go bad when I go to, you know, use it. Okay, we'll freeze this and then you can use it, you can thaw it out and use it as a dip or to spread on sandwiches or whatever you want. And that's it. This is Anne for iLiveToCoupon.com.